Global Marketing Strategy, Mark 7018, Lecture 2, Deciding Which Markets to Enter, Part 2, International Market Selection. The market profile analysis includes a PESTO analysis, then a layer of trading practices analysis, consumer behavior analysis, finance analysis, competition analysis, and tariff barriers analysis. The next layer or inner layer is the 4P marketing mix analysis strategy. International market segmentation. This framework summarizes segmentation international markets. Having carried out the aforementioned scanning stage, the international marketing manager must then analyze and identify markets in greater detail. Segmentation is used. Criteria for effective segmentation. Measurability refers to available, credible, and current statistics to support this opportunity. Accessibility refers to current available market opportunity. Sustainability or profitability, will this operation be sustainable and profitable in the long term? Actionability refers to the degree to which the organization has sufficient resources to formulate effective marketing programs and make things happen. Basis for Segmentation International Markets The sources and type of research we conduct that determines the foundation of our decision needs to be weighed as general characteristics that are highly measurable, accessible and actionable, or reliable hard data versus softer specific characteristics that have a low degree of measurability, accessibility and actionability, however still vary with high degree of relevance in specific scenarios, such as cultural similarities and differences. All of the above are key to international marketeers and may be used singularly or in combination as a basis for segmentation. Screening of segments. Preliminary screening, coarse-grained, macro-oriented screening methods based on certain criteria, for example, Export restrictions, GNP per capita, cars owned per 1,000 of the population, government spending as a percentage of GNP, population per hospital bed. Following macro-level screening, researchers move towards a more micro-oriented approach. Fine-grained screening, business portfolio matrix. In this matrix, we are comparing country attractiveness on the horizontal axis with company's compatibility with each country on the vertical axis. Primary opportunity, best opportunities for long-term strategic development. Secondary opportunity, opportunities are identified by political or economic risk is perceived as being too high to make long-term commitments. Tertiary opportunity, catch what you can market, get in and get out, no significant research would be carried out. Ideally, we would like to be within the three red maroon colored squares, top left corner of the matrix. Questionnaire for analyzing countries on business portfolio matrix. This chart is an example of the type of detailed criteria we would consider when ranking a country's attractiveness based on our thorough and current research and due diligence.